I hope you clicked on this show because you're in Portland and you're trying to invest in real estate and you are having trouble getting started because you just don't have enough money. You're like, dude, there's got to be another way. Guess what? There is, and I'm going to show it to you right now. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show, folks. Today's show is from a man, Melvin, an investor from the Portland area. Now, Melvin, I am here to help you invest in real estate with the lowest amount of money possible. I'm here to help you take a small amount of money and stretch it as far as you can, right? You living in the Portland area, you're dealing with untenable housing prices and unrealistic landlord-tenant laws, right? So you're like, there's got to be a better way, man. Help me out. It's exactly what I'm doing, right? I'm taking you and I'm getting you a property in a better market, a market that makes sense from a real estate perspective. And then my team handles all the on the ground work. That's what we do. We specialize in taking people from Portland and getting them in the markets that make the most sense from a cash flow perspective. And today I got a house for you that you're only going to need 13 grand and it's going to kick off a huge cash on cash return. Let's take a look. Man, I hate those other real estate gurus out there. Those real estate gurus that lead you guys to believe fairy tales, lead you guys to believe in magic, lead you guys to think that there's going to be genies granting your wishes if you buy their course or their program. Like there's going to be hot girls in bikinis just popping out. That's not the real life of a real estate investor. And here on Holton Wise TV, we give it to you straight. Welcome back, folks. Let's take a look at this deal. Now, today's deal is going to be in Northeast Ohio, little little city y'all probably ain't ever heard of. It's called Lorraine, Ohio, okay? Lorraine, Ohio is big for you. It's big because it ain't big. Ain't nobody know about it, right? When you Google the best cash flow markets in the USA, you come across the usual suspects. Memphis, Indy, Kansas City, Cleveland, right? You ain't ever hear about Lorraine. That's good. Lorraine is actually about a half hour west of Cleveland, so it's still in the general market. Now, my team, we work all over Northeast Ohio, Cleveland, Lorraine, the whole shebang, okay? <clears throat> in this little area, the pricing is even better than Cleveland, and you also don't have to do with the new lead paint regulations that the city of Cleveland has enacted, right? For more info on that, check out uh, the video I linked to in the notes here, right? Because this new Cleveland lead law, that's wild, right? And it's throwing a lot of investors who are thinking about the Cleveland market off. But folks, here's the thing with the Cleveland market. Cleveland is one city in a whole big market. That market, we're looking at like four or five million people. City of Cleveland, where this new lead law is uh, being enforced, only like 350,000 people, okay? So uh, you could go to other areas where the pricing is a little bit better right now, and you're not dealing with like a new regulation that they're still working out uh, the kinks on, right? Because, you know, right now they're it's, it's kind of a mess. You'll have to check out the video, right? So with that said, that's what I do, right? I find you guys the deals where they make the most sense. And this one is going to make a lot of sense for a lot of people, okay? 3209 Camden Ave, Lorraine. It's been on the market four days, priced at 55 k We need to offer 55 right? No messing around, folks. This thing is going to be a moneymaker. It's already renovated. A little single-family home. You already got the fresh carpet, the gray paint. It's looking good, right? Renovated kitchen. This thing is exactly what we want. New hot water tank. Those cost like 1200 bucks. last about 15 years. Like everything is done, right? This investment is totally turnkey. And what are we going to be able to do here? Well, we're going to be able to bring in nine seventy-five a month in rent, okay? Go cash. We can go Section 8, right? I think voucher tenants are the best because that is consistent income, right? They lose their job. We still get our rent. They can't work because of some corona mandate. They still get the rent to us because the government is guaranteeing it, baby. But you could also go cash, right? Nice little C-grade area. I like this area quite a bit. I'm big on this area. In addition, there's going to be two naval bases being built. In this area, right? Two naval bases. They're going to add like three or 4,000 jobs in the next year or two. That's big for a little community like this, right? As far as uh, fixed and variable expense estimates, at the end of the day, this thing should pan out with my team handling the management. 
You're supposed to bring in 11.7, but I have to factor in fixed and variable expense estimates for you guys, right? So you're looking at, by the end of it, approximately six and a half because we got to factor in things like your taxes, your insurance, your utilities, your lawn care, of course, our management fee. And then I'm also factoring in other things. Now, I know the house is renovated, but I want you to save five eighty five for repairs and maintenance, five eighty five for vacancy and non payment, five eighty five for CapEx, right? That's really money that goes back to you on top of that sixty five, but I want you saving that like fifteen, sixteen hundred a year because eventually you'll do that hot water tank, right? Costs like twelve hundred bucks, but they only last fifteen years, right? So in fifteen years you got a twelve hundred dollar bill coming, right? The roof, right? It's like a five thousand dollar roof. They last thirty years. Uh, I think we got like at least like 10 years left. We'll verify that during the inspection, but you'll need to spend that 5k, right? That's what this stuff is, right? You're, you're factoring that in, right? It's pie in the sky to believe you'll never have costs. That's why people from all over the world come to Holton Wise, because we break down the costs for you guys in the most realistic way I have ever seen, right? And we handle all the management, of course, right? So... Wherever you're living, it doesn't matter, folks. Live where you want, invest where it makes sense. My team does the on-the-ground work. We do the property management. We do the maintenance. We do the construction. If the tenant eats too much Taco Bell and jacks up that toilet, I got people to handle that, right? If the tenant doesn't pay rent, we will handle the eviction. When it come, comes time to get new tenants, my team does it all. We will even insure any rental property in Ohio, right? It's complete one-stop shopping. We take care of it, and your reasonable expectation of performance is about 6500 a year. And this is where it gets good. You don't need a lot of money, folks. If we go at 55K, all you got to do is put down $13,750. we will get you a lender that kicks in the other forty-one grand. That, folks, is going to pencil out to a projection of a 33% cash-on-cash return. Completely passive. My team does it all. The only thing you need to do is move quick because this property is probably going to be gone within a matter of days. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.